Rabotai, I'm about to tell today over something. A cure, the famous cure for everything that you can imagine. You ready? Who wants to hear this? And this is not my cure. For a cure to any illness, to any segula, to any illness in the world. You ready, Rabotai? Listen. This is not my cure. It's Rabbi Yonatan Ibershitz's cure. Okay? What does he say? Rabotai, there was Christians. They came to Rabbi Yonatan Ibershitz and they wanted a Yanni, uh, you know, you know, Yanni, how do they say? Instigate. Harek, instigate, instigate, instigate. And they tell him like this. You Jews, you guys only pray for the Jews. You don't pray for the Christians. You don't pray for the world. He says, what are you talking about? What are you talking about? He said, what's the beracha that you say in the Amidah? Rofei chole amo Yisrael. What does that mean? Sma, Dahud, Sma. Says, what did he say? Rofei chole amo Yisrael. You Hashem heal the nation Israel. That means you don't pray for Christians. You don't pray for Muslims. You don't pray for anything else but yourselves. You guys are only for the Jewish people you pray for. Tell me. What would you answer the Christians in this situation? Mike, do me a favor. Shut the door, please. What would you answer, Albert? Ah, Salim, you have an answer for me? I oh, know. You don't have an answer, huh? You can't, you can't have an answer for this one. This is the, this is Jonathan Ibershitz has to answer this. You ready? Rabbi Jonathan Ibershitz answers. He says, in front of his Talmidim, he says, What's the Rofei Which Beracha is it in the Amidah Rofei Cholem Moisel? Which, what number in the Beracha? Huh? Six, seven, seven, eight. Albert, who said eight? It's Ruga. It's very nice, Ruga. It's the eighth Beracha in the Amidah. Rofei Chole Amo Yisrael is the eighth Beracha in the Amidah. So you know what he tells the Christians? Do you guys have Brimila? You don't have Brimila. We have Brimila. When do we do Brimila? Day day. Day day. So that's why we pray so the guy, the kid can get Brimila. The genius, the genius of Rina is. But you want to know something? His students came to me after, but Rabbi, give us the real answer. Give us the real answer. You said that for them. Yeah, you're right. But why don't we pray for Klai Yisrael? Why don't we pray for the Goyim? Why don't we pray for the Muslim? Why don't we pray for that? Ah, you hear that, boys? You hear his question? No, 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 no. You want to hear what he said? He answered him like this. Because a Jewish person and a Goyish person the Goy, what does he believe in? He believes in the medicine. He believes in the doctor. He says, the second you put your bitachon and imunah in doctors and medicine, Hashem says, okay, kavod, go do it. But the Jewish people, they put their imunah and bitachon where? In HaKadosh Baruch Of course you have to do it. Of course you have to take your medication if a person has to have medication. Of course he has to go to the doctor. However, yes, he healthy. However, you have to understand, the cure to everything is what? Hashem. The cure to everything is Hashem. Ad I told you about Chizkiyahu HaMelech. Chizkiyahu HaMelech. What did he put in Geniza? What did he put in Geniza, Albert? He put the Sefer Refuot. There was a book of Refuah that everybody, if you would have had this book, you'll be able to cure. Why did you do it? And the rabbis agreed with him. It's good that you put it away. Because people, what were they doing? What were they doing? Oh, oh, okay, the guy has, a, has the flu. Okay, do this. Put some na'na, put some water, put some za'atan, shake it up and swallow it. Chalas! says, no, 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 no. That's not it, Mike. That's not the cure for the flu. But at the end of the day, what do you do? Tao, please, tao, tao, please. So he says, says, and that's what he says. He says, this is the biggest cure. The cure is when you have a munayin bitachon na kadosh baruch hu, then Hashem says, you're relying on me. Yiftach bi. I have everything. What does it say in the Torah? Li ha-kesev li The guy wants to be rich all day long. He's trying, trying, trying. Habotai. Who has the money? Speak to the boss. It's like a cha-ching, cha-ching. You have all things flying down. Of course, you have to do hishtadut. Of course, you have to do your part. The guy wants chokmah. He wants wisdom. He's trying to learn the sugya. He can't figure it out. What's going on? Pray to Borei Olam. Pray! And Abotai, this is the secret that the Rav Yonatan, it's not even a secret, everybody knows this. Rav Yonatan Ha'ibish has said, you know why we pray Rofei Choleh Amo Yisrael? Because the Jews have a munan bidachon in Borei Olam and not in the doctors and the medication. Of course, you do Yishtalut. But, 
את סייעתא דשמיא, פרמה הקדוש ברוך הוא, להסביר לנביא.